The Ivert 2M T moguls were designed by George Ivert for the London, Midland, and Scottish Railway and were all built from the late 1940s to the early 1950s. The locomotives were a tender version of Ivert's 2M T tanks which were built at the same time. Regardless of it being a tank engine 2MT or a tendered 2MT they were both built for mixed traffic work. The larger 2MT moguls were used mainly on the open main line, while the smaller tanks were sent to branch lines in the west of England. A single LMS 2MT mogul weighs 84 tons total, and obviously they could haul heavier loads than their smaller 262 2MT tank engines. Ivert's 2MTs inspired Robert Riddles at British Railways to build 65 standard 2MT moguls and 32 MT tanks. Out of the 128 LMS Ivert 2MT moguls that were built, a handful of them are preserved today. And there are also four surviving standard 2MTs as well, two of which are based at the Great Central Railway in Nottingham. This 2MT 46521 to me, is the most well-known 2MT, it's been given nicknames like the Green Mouse and has been painted in both green and black. It once came off the rails at Corn and Woodhouse Station, due to a problem with the signalman, but it did return after a month's repair work. These engines always looked odd to me, that small boiler makes it look like you have taken a cannon and spliced it onto a steam locomotive chassis. Please let me know what your opinion of the 2MT is in the comment section.